Hey guys, this is Shaw Kirby 707, and welcome back to Super Mario RPG. In the last part, we defeated Culex, and it was a pretty long battle, I must admit, but still, we got rid of him. <laughs> yeah, a Final Fantasy character in the Mario game. How impressive was that? <laughs> But anyways, in this part, we're going to find out where the last star is. So let's talk to Mal's parents. Alright, so let's go up to them and talk. Mom, Dad, were you able to find the star here? Yeah, the accident rangers took it away from us, but we got it back again. Yeah, we sure did. We kicked their butt. That's wonderful. Now the star, uh, star thing can be repaired, right? Not exactly. We only need one more star. I guess not. You're still missing a piece, I take it. Yes, that's correct, your highness. The last star. Wait, the only place left to look is in Bowser's Keep. Oh yeah, maybe. Yeah, we know, but there's no way to get in. Believe me, we tried, but... Yes, yes, even more can jump that far. Well, thanks a lot. <laughs> Alright, I'll let you use the... That's it, dear. You should use the royal bus. The royal bus? Um, okay, what is that? Yes, Mal, the time has come for you to take the bus. Wow, when I was your age, and he's blabbing on about himself again. Really? Are you sure it's alright? Of course, dear. I ordered the repairman to have it fixed by the time you leave. You simply have to help Mario and others get that last star. You bet, Mom. Come on, Mario, let's go. Alright, so... They say that the last star is about to keep, and we can use the royal bus, so let's use the royal bus. Alright, so let's get back outside. It'd probably have been quicker if I went to the other exit, but, eh, I prefer this exit. <laughs> I mean, it'd be fun to fall off the cliff one last time, but, yeah, yeah, we'll just walk there. <laughs> so if you guys are wondering where the royal bus is, it's right next to Garo's house, which is the sculptor. Man, there's a lot of statues in this place, I must admit. Alright, so anyways, um, it's right through here, so let's actually go to the Royal Bus. Now, before you go, uh, well, actually, you could come back. Let's just go on through. I was to say you won't be able to come back, but, yeah, never mind. Forget what I said. The bus has finally been repaired. We can start repopulating again. Awesome! <laughs> now we can go on the bus. Prince Mallow, we want to go, we want to go to Bowser's Keep. Could you give us a lift there? I heard the story from King Nimbus. He'll be there in no time. And I think I hear the bus. Here it comes, here it comes. Alright, and it's apparently a lucky dude riding the bus. And it has the initial JB. Hmm. I believe there is a translation of what that means. Uh, I'm not exactly sure, but I think I think it's some I think it means something in Japanese, but I'm not exactly sure. So how's the engine running? Oh, it's purring like a kitten. Could shake Prince Mallow to the entrance of Bowser's Keep? Of course, can't wait to get this thing running again. Come, Prince, hop on board. Alright, like you said, let's hop on board. <laughs> I bet it's comfy too. All aboard! We're off! And here we go! To Bowser's Keep! So finally we reached Bowser's Keep after a long time! Since episode 1 of this LP, we finally go back to Bowser's Keep. Yeah, it's been that long, I must admit! And there is everyone you watching! And they see us in the distance! Alright! Here we are, we are breaking into Bowser Keep once again. And everyone's cheering and saying, Yay, good luck! Da, da, da. Alright, so here we are in Bowser's Keep. Ah, the scent of boiling lava. It's so nice to be home. It's really gonna pay for stealing my splendid castle from me. Alright, now you could go back, so yeah, luckily you can go back to Bowser's Keep any time, which is really nice. So now we can enter Bowser's Keep freely, but let's keep on going because I don't really have anything else to do, so let's keep on going. Now, if you have Bowser in your party, um, some of the enemies will not attack you, like I'll show right now. Like these guys! Yeah, Bowser is scaring the monster, so if you have Bowser in the party, whether he's in the battle or not, he can actually scare them, or sometimes it will affect them. Um, I wanted to show the other facts, and apparently you're scaring all the monsters! Bowser, stop scaring them! I want some experience too, you know! 
All right, I really want to show it in. Apparently, Bowser's gonna scare everybody else. My God. Wow, Bowser, you really are scary. Well, we'll take these gals out in no time. My goodness. All right, there we go. The four gears are enraptured. All right. And Bowser's scaring these red guys. I believe they're called Terracotas. Um, those Terracotas have 180 HP. They got spells of Terra Punch. We against nothing, strong against fire, attack is 120, defense is 185, magic attack, magic attack is 36, and magic defense is 35. And these guys, they are called Forkies. Forkies have 350 HP, they got spells of storm, we can guess nothing, strong against nothing, attack is 170, defense is 120, magic attack is 158, and magic defense is 128. Yeah, if you have Bowser, sometimes it will affect the enemy, sometimes they won't attack you, which is really, really awesome. Alright, yeah, I decided to have Bowser in the battle one last time because pretty much for the rest of this game I won't be able to, I won't be using him because he's not really all that useful. I mean despite having a lot of power, I don't find Bowser really all that useful. Well I mostly find Peach and Gino really useful. And Mallow as well, but I won't be using Mallow for most of the part. Maybe one battle I might, but pretty much I don't really find Mallow as useful as Gino, but I just wanna avoid these guys, I don't really wanna fight them. And we got another enemies! Alright, and these guys are called Goo Goombas. Goo Goombas have 132 HP. They got spells of Thornet. The weak against nothing, strong against nothing, attack is 115, defense is 66, magic attack is 13, and magic defense is 66. Alright, uh, let's attack them. Alright, so yeah, pretty much about Bowser Keep is the last area in this game. I mean, we're not in the fi finale yet, but this is the last area. But yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is a long area to be exact, so you be you're gonna be here for quite a while. I will say at least seven parts, maybe, I don't know. That's my estimate, seven parts. And once again, another new enemy. Alright, you scare that one. You scare that one. You scare that one. And he didn't scare the tubby, of course. But those green guys, uh, the green, um, I think they're called Malakupas, I think. I think they were called Malakupas. Yeah, those green paratroopers, I believe they were called Malakupas. I believe they have 95 HP. They got no spell. They're weak against thunder. Strong against nothing. Attack is 130. Defense is 120. Magic is 47. And magic defense is 98. And this is a Tuba Troopa. Tuba Troopa has 500 HP. They got no spell. The weak against thunder. Strong against nothing. Attack is 200. Defense is 80. Match attack is 7. And match defense is 34. Alright, so let's take care of this guy. Now, they, the red ones are weak to jump, but these guys are weak to thunder. Which is kind of weird, actually. You know what? Let's use Thunderbolt. How about that? I mean, I'm pretty sure Thunderbolt will take care of this guy. Yeah, not too bad. You want to use Shocker. I mean, that Thunderbolt does a decent amount of damage. Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's just pass through these guys. Okay, finally. Yeah, um, that Goomba ran towards me, so I, I was in two off-screen fights. But anyway, let's go inside here. And it's completely dark. Yeah, so you may want to watch out where you're going. If you go this way, there's actually a flower right here. No, actually a mushroom. Excuse me. So, yeah, kind of watch out where you're going, jump over these guys, and you should be out of here. And there's a save block, but I don't think I'm going to save, so... Well, maybe I should, but... Mm, nah, I'm not going to save. Alright, but there's Croco here, actually. Hey, Mario, did you remember to use a save point? There's plenty of danger up ahead, so it's best to save now. You need anything? I got some items to sell. And yeah! Croco is actually being nice to us, and he has plenty of items for us, but we don't need to buy anything, so, yeah. Um, you know what? I think it's a good time to save. I don't normally save in recording, but I guess it was a good time to save, because, yeah, I'd rather save right now. Alright, there we go. So we're in Bowser's Keep. Awesome. Alright, so anyways, let's go. And, here we are. Now, there are six doors. Um, yeah, sure, why not? We'll have an explanation. Of the six doors, to open onto action courses, you can handle a lot of action, right? <laughs> yeah, there are two doors that have action courses, which is platforming. Two others will lead you to battle courses, which you battle um, multiple enemies. Two open into puzzle, which um, you will do quizzes. So, yeah. 
And that's pretty much it. Once you choose a course, there's no turning back. The only way to know what's behind the door is to walk through it. You must pass four of the six courses to move ahead. Now, um, if you pass um, some um, some doors, you actually get weapons for some of the characters in your team. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna, if I'll get all of them. I won't be able to get all the weapons, but um, I'll try my best to get some of them that I want. But it's all random because. Yeah, all doors are random. It's different for each player. But yeah, can I go back? Yes, I can. Okay, so I could have saved. Okay, never mind. No, I do not need any explanation. No, I don't. No thanks. Alright, so I guess we'll go to for door number four. How about that? And it's a, a, a battle. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to battle these monsters. So I guess uh, we'll just fight these guys, I guess. <laughs> You know what? I could speed this up, so yeah. You know what? Chipmunk Skevin? Yeah, you got it. It's not even worth it. 
not too bad. Uh, Zeo Star, yeah, you guys are weak too. Oh, we have some shamans as well. You know what? Take care of those Zeo Star because they can heal the other enemies. So let's attack them first. And magic and Dombrey is actually going to heal shamans, so do not use magic against them because they can use magic as well. Oh, wow, we're taking these guys in one hit, which I'm really, I'm really loving right now. Lightning Orb. Yeah, go use your Lightning Orb. I don't care, mister. <laughs> Alright, come on. Okay, we should be almost done. I believe there's only three corridors of monsters, so we should be almost done with this. No, I do not want to risk it again. Alright, so Peach and Ninja's level 29. And let's give her magic. Magic has a biggest boost. Alright, if you guys didn't know, the highest, the highest level you can reach is level 30. So, one more level for most of the characters and you'll be done. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, you know what? I'll switch up now. <laughs> Gino's weapon. So let's equip that right now. Alright, so let's equip the Star Gun, because that's actually a really good weapon for Gino. And that's actually the last weapon in the game for Gino. So, how much does that raise, I wonder? Eh, by 12. Eh, it's okay. Alright, so I think that's it, guys. So, once you go through this door, you're back to where you started. But, we will take care of the next, the next door in the next part. So, next time on Super Mario RPG, we will go through another door. So, I will see you guys then. So, this is Shell Kirby 707 saying, 